Hey guys, welcome back. Today I will be playing Jupiter's Tower of Hell and I'll be playing the Tower of Madness or Tom as you can see over here in the beginner towers. Let's get straight into it. Like the previous two towers and all the rest of the towers, just walk in and here we go. We've started off and head up these uh, blocks and then some simple one stud wraparounds so it shouldn't uh, be much of a trouble if you have completed the past two or even harder ones this one you can you can just walk past them but that's more dangerous because the path to walk past them is very small uh, just a couple more those ones you can walk past very easily and then go around that one and you wear onto the orange you can just jump all across these it doesn't well it takes kind of quite a bit but you won't if you don't fall you won't take much more damage so these are like swing head hitters you, there we go and then the next one and next one next one and actually go forward on this and jump while you're at about here to head on to this one more head hitters if you fall you can just jump across there onto that one but I'll take the head hit away please because I don't want to get rid of any of my health go onto the ladder you can either jump backwards or stand on there then jump onto this this you just jump over it's not too hard um, over here you can take the long way but the way I prefer and is much faster is just head do the not one sec yeah and then again head onto this one right here over here then you can do it again head onto this and then you can jump onto jump onto one sec jump oh my gosh jump 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 onto that one finally um then just head across here and you are done that section now we're on to pink you just go here across these Ooh. Uh, then you can go onto that one, or you can go a long way. So if you're not that confident, you should go the long way because it's less like I just spotted a skip. As you can slightly see, there's four dots here. You can jump onto that and skip to here. That's pretty cool. I just found that out. So then you continue from here it goes there then up here so you continue up if you're like newer to obbies and you're not that good then I wouldn't recommend some skips others I would like in uh, Tower of Annoyingly Simple Trials that those skips are very easy to do so just do them honestly I th oh yes that's what I forgot you can actually while on top of there you can skip there's a big skip right there which is a ladder and then a platform at the end saves you quite a bit of time actually uh, if you I like to do that for a bit and then if you know how to do it, uh, you can try and ladder flick up like this. But if you don't know how to do that, I'd recommend go to a corner bit like this and just do this. It's pretty easy, so you shouldn't have that much trouble with that. And then over here, I can just do that 
and then you go over here let me just strain myself up over here just jump across these they get slightly longer to jump across at the end but they shouldn't be too bad there's an outside bit so you can skip that and go straight onto there and again bam and can we no I'm not gonna risk that so onto here and over here now for here we just you can just jump jump onto these you can skip the last two by doing that you can go across this like that then go forward onto these ones the first one's a two by two and the next one's two by fours so it should be reasonably easy and then next is some triangles and then more two by fours now four by four to jump onto and this one you can hold uh, right or left or forward or whatever to just walk across those this one you go here and then just jump across these ones that are connected to the wall also you can go over here to get to the other side and do the other ones that are connected to the wall then there's more on this wall there's a safety net down there so in case you fall right there and then these one uh, one star width ones they can be kind of scary but not too bad and not too hard to get the hang of um, you can do a skip somewhere uh, over there you can skip a bit how high can I jump now nah, won't try to do that just in case so we head across these you can just jump on there then head across these ones these hardly even move so you shouldn't have too much trouble I don't know why this is there honestly I think it's just in case oh you can do a skip right there and that helps you onto here so you can time this way better Otherwise, it will be very hard to time it from in there because you won't be able to see much. You can just skip that one. You can also, yep, just skip the first bit by jumping onto this ladder. Then, uh, just ladder flick up there. Like that. Or you can just go the long way like those ladders. Honestly, the long way would be easier for most people. Uh, you can head on to that ladder if you would like, but there's a skip right there. And then this over here, are the this is the second last floor. These giant triangles with ladders. They can be a little scary at the edges, but just align yourself correctly and they should be alright over here just go up here then this ladder at the edge of that one now this jump can be scary for some people but uh, just make sure you are at the very end or near the end and then just jump across and then there's more ladders like th all right I went out the wrong side yep this side now now on to the final stretch Make sure not to fall on these. Well, it's pretty hard to fall on them, but um, just don't. There's a lot of ladders and a lot of the uh, triangle things or rhombuses or diamonds or whatever you call them. And then this is the final one. Yes, and then you go over here and this is the wind patch. So you just go bump. And then look behind you when you were done, touch the green brick to go back to the spawn. 
uh, just go back to spawn there or read this if you would like pause it right here to read that or go to my past videos like the tower of annoyingly simple trials right there in that video I uh, read that out so you know and then you can go to the screen big and you're back to the lobby uh, you will also get a badge and then in the chat it will say uh, your name has beaten Tower of Madness in and then your time. So this is the end of the video. If you enjoyed, please like, subscribe and hit the notification button to get notified when I make a new video. Thanks for watching and see you all next time.